Hey everyone, Brian here with Audio Plugin Deals. Today we're going to check out the Resonance Emotional Mallets from Impact Soundworks. Before we get started checking this one out, make sure you like the video and subscribe to the channel and hit that bell notification icon so you know when we go live with videos and great deals just like this. All right, guys, so here's the uh, Impact Soundworks Resonance Emotional Mallets. Before I get started with this, this is not your standard um, mallet, like orchestral mallets and, you know, vibraphone and marimba and stuff like that. So here we have two separate folders here. We have uh, designed and natural. So using these natural samples, uh, we have anything from whale drums, pot lids, pipes, metals, bowed metals, stuff like that. Um, and you can design your own sounds with this, so they're just kind of plain, fairly, very dry. So you can, you know, use your own plugins to mangle those or add reverb or do whatever you want with it. There's also some effects here, as you can see. Um, I think what most of the fun is is in the design patches or designing your own patches like this using the natural sample so you have a choice between either one so let's check out some of the designed patches because that's where a lot of the sound design uh, goodies come from
All right, so that gives you a good idea of what you can do with this library. I think all of those were very interesting sounds, and they had a lot of kind of crazy, unique, resonant textures, as well as kind of impacts and effects and atonal sounds as well. Um, you can use these for cinematic music. You can use it for sound design, trailers, pretty much anything, um, because it has melodic instruments as well as percussive and those kind of atonal uh, unnerving sounds as well so I think it's a great library I was pleasantly surprised by this one uh, resonance emotional mallets from impact soundworks the name might be a bit uh, misleading because we do have you know mallet type instruments but I think the bulk of this library is found in those sound design patches and it's not your typical uh, say orchestral mallet uh, library thanks for checking this one out with me I will see you guys next time